Molly. I have been really inspired by an artist on Instagram. Her name is Jessica Swan. I'll link her description down below. But she does some beautiful pieces using just fluid acrylics. So I had some golden acrylics and I'm going to use those and a water spray bottle and I'm just going to play around, have fun, see what comes out. And then afterwards, um, I might add a little bit of um, abstract detail to it. So let's go. All right, so a little bit different camera angle today. I wanted to try something that was inspired by um, a wonderful artist that is on, ooh, that was a lot, <laughs> on Instagram. Her name is Jessica Swan. I'm sure a ton of people know her and I'll link her down below. But I just wanted to try the high flow acrylics today. So I'll go through um, and maybe I will talk about all of them materials later, but I have a spray bottle of water. I've got my high flow acrylics here and I'm gonna use my paddle brush and blend these colors in. And I have a little bit of yellow as well. I don't know if I'll use that, but let me just blend all these colors together. spraying some water on there just so that I can get a good flow and then I'm literally just going to drop little droplets of the high flow. There's so many uses for high flow you can actually mix it with pouring medium. You can do technique like this. I am a little bit afraid of the yellow in there but I'm all up for experimenting, so we'll see how that part goes. And then a little bit more. Whoops, needed to clean that off. And then here comes the magic of the white. So I'm gonna do a little bit of a spray here. Okay, guys so here is what I did to this piece so this was really just that spray bottle of water and high flow acrylics they move so much so fast so I really recommend if you're going to be trying any of this have a very level canvas parts that I really loved they ended up kind of moving and spreading out um 
the you can see some of the colors were like oh, there's a piece of hair in there they were really glossy um, others dried kind of matte these are those are some really beautiful effects that happened in there but what I ended up doing was coming back in with um, some actual acrylic paint and just kind of layering in interest and design. I really like the yellow in this. So this is a very abstract piece for me. It almost looks um, like graffiti-like. Um, not, my, not my usual at all, but I was just really trying to, to push myself for something different. So this is definitely a work in progress. I'm going to try some more pieces like this. I put a little bit too much water, a little bit too much paint. I think maybe having some more white on the edges would soften this up, but I'm really happy as a first go. Um, you guys make sure you check out um, my link below for the inspiration, Jess Wan. She does some amazing stuff. So thank you guys for watching me experiment, and I will see you on the next one. Yep, the painting. Bye.